All right, Lana, what do you say? Frisch is big boy? You do the fries, I'll do the burger? I thought the other one was creepy that I showed last time. This one's, I think, even creepier. All the more reason for hurry. Ready to do this video together? <laughs> you want fries? Well, the fridge is still ahead with your order whenever you're ready. Hi, I just need a big boy burger and fries. Anything to drink? Nope, just that. Alright, one big boy and one fries. Thank you. Today's video brought to you by the one and only Brent Bushnell. He tipped the show, but he's getting a video today. Nope, almost hit the wall. You paying for this one? So today I'm gonna review the burger, Lionel's gonna review the fries. So it's a double feature. You can't just like go through the drive through window, that's not a good protocol. So to start this whole Sean's first time eating thing, I filmed this at the end of 2021. I talked about how I had never had a big boy burger in Detroit, and then really kind of spiraled into this whole thing where I realized there's Bob's Big Burgers out in California, there's the big boy that was like the Michigan big boy, and then there's Frisch's Big Boy, which I've never had in Ohio, so today, and I said I was gonna do it if I was ever back in here, so this is the perfect excuse. I've got a wedding later today, so I took the dog out, we're gonna have him have some fries, and I'm gonna do a Sean's first time eating Frisch's Big Boy Burger. I also wanna point out that I don't think the big boys where I'm from have drive throughs Not that I remember, so this is super convenient. You excited for fries? Lionel's looking straight ahead at rallies. <laughs> he knows those are the elite fries. Here you go. Thank you, have a great day. Can I thank the receipt from you too? Yep. Ooh, the crinkle fries. Damn, they're hot though. You gotta be careful. You go. Thank you, have a great day. Okay, here. You gotta tell them how you like it. Nice and quick one here today before I head back down to downtown Detroit. Look at the beautiful fries. Uh, big boy in my town does not do crinkle cut fries. They do regular kind of like potato-y steak fries. These never harness a lot of salt. You can see the grease and the big boy logo that is so similar to the other one. So the big boy was before the Big Mac. So the Big Mac copied Big Boy. <laughs> Knowledge. Oh wow, and there's not a sesame seed bun right away. And the burgers look, a the patties look a little more smashed. Like a little more smash patty. That looks like more like a diner burger than the other one did in my other video. Like this really doesn't look the same. Right off the bat, I think this looks and feels way better. Also, burger and fries was cheaper. It was about eight bucks as opposed to 10 bucks in Detroit. Brent tipped the show, so he's getting a video today. Is it good? Frisch is big boy. Cheers. I prefer this so much more. This is way more my speed. The bread, even the middle bread, is so much more manageable, it all is one. They're taking out the trash. Let them do their job. This is such a better big boy burger than the Michigan like big boy franchise. That big, like also remember the bun was all falling apart on me? This is fantastic. I think he's giving the fries a perfect score. They also put mayonnaise. So they put the big boy sauce, like the relishy sauce, is what I think that is, and then also a mayonnaise. It tastes way more relishy. This is so good. The crinkle cut fries are so much like more old school too. That's it. Delayed. I smashed this. The drive through is clutch. That was a better burger. I had to go in and get the other one back in December, remember that? That was made to order, it was like piping hot. Everything about that situation. I'm in Bowling Green, Ohio. That Frisch's Big Boy was top notch. <laughs> Stop. Okay, hold the phone. That wasn't a mayonnaise. The internet is telling me it's tartar sauce. Tartar sauce on a burger. The Big Boy that I'm used to has, I think, 
mayonnaise, relish, and ketchup mixed together maybe is what it's saying? Yeah, they even sell the Frisch's tartar sauce. Whoa, it looked like there was like a Thousand Islandy sauce and like a white sauce. I just assumed it was mayo. Maybe that was tartar sauce, and then was there another sauce on there? It was, whatever it was, it was so good. You guys will let me know, you're the, you're the big boy experts, because I found that out the easy way, I guess, last time when you watched the video. So, absolutely fantastic. I love that burger. That destroyed the Michigan one. I've said it five times. Nothing like sitting in the car with your best friend and eating fries, you know? All right, guys, that's gonna be the video. Thank you so much for having a quick lunch with me here today. I'm gonna head to downtown Detroit, see one of my best friends get married, hang out with a bunch of people I haven't seen in a long time. If you wanna tip the show and this is a part of your daily life, the Venmo, the cash at the PayPal, you can do that. Brent didn't even know I was gonna be making a video for him today. He tipped the show, and you know how it is, dude. If I, uh, if I can use tip money to buy myself a quick lunch and I get to pick what I get, because I wanted to come here since I heard all about the different big boys. So I'll see you again tomorrow for a brand new video. Hoping to splice in some wedding clips and fun downtown Detroit stuff uh, in the very near future. And also the video with my brother will be dropping very soon. I just want to put the time in to edit that one. I don't want to just like throw that out. Bowling Green, you've been great. Burger, fantastic. Lionel, still wants fries, fantastic. That's a perfect score on this show. That's all you need to know. It's almost 60 degrees and this person behind me is smoking two cigarettes at once and wearing a 1990s Ohio State starter jacket. Keep being you.